What's up guys, welcome to a new video. Today I'm going to show you how to edit HDR footage inside of Final Cut Pro without any other third-party plugins required. I've come to the problem when I want to edit the footage from my new iPhone 13 Pro that it looks like this. When we drag it into the timeline, you can see we get a small warning. Adding HDR clip to SDR project. Bright content will be clipped in this project to adjust the image's brightness, apply a color correction effect or apply the HDR tools effect to this clip. Let's click on OK and watch back the footage. As you can see, it is way too bright. By the way, this clip is from my iPhone 13 Pro camera test. In case you haven't watched the video already, be sure to watch it by clicking up here, but you don't have to, of course. Let's go on with the video. We could correct this clip by going to the color correction tools here. It's right up here. If you're in the video inspector, you can just click on this thing and you're in the color inspector. But I think most of you know this already. We can go to the exposure tab and then drag the highlights down by quite a bit, maybe even the midtones and not so much the shadows. And then we have kind of a somewhat fixed clip, but this isn't the best way to do it, of course. So let's reset all of these parameters and go to the effects tab down here. In the search bar, we type in HDR. Simple as that. And we have the HDR tools effect, which we just drag onto our clip and we still have kind of a bright clip. But once we go into the video inspector, we can go to mode. And instead of HDR to Rec 709 SDR, we select HLG to Rec 709 SDR. And as you can see, we have a perfectly fixed clip now without applying anything to the color board. So now we can do our real adjustments, maybe bring the exposure down a little bit or make it a little bit brighter if you want. But since we have the HDR tools effect applied, we have the perfect normal SDR clip in our timeline perfectly fixed and ready to color grade or color correct or do anything that you would like to do with this clip. And that's already it from this video. Quick little tip on how to edit HDR footage from, for example, the iPhone 13 Pro in Final Cut Pro. So many pros, it's also everything from Apple. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please be sure to hit that like button and also consider subscribing for more videos just like this one. You can find more videos right here and right here. Here's the iPhone 13 Pro camera test review, whatever, if you haven't watched it and you wanna watch it. And you can subscribe right here and I will hopefully see you in the next video. Goodbye.